Okay, today is February 17th. This incident of this ceiling damage happened on November 8th, 2020. Today is November, uh, today is um, February 17th, 2021. This incident happened on November 8th, two, uh, this, no, yeah, November 8th, 2020. What you're seeing up here, right there. see where that light picture is? Mm -hmm. All that's water damage. Okay? Mm -hmm. That water damage damaged my bed that I had in here. My bed as well as my box spring. I asked and requested they replace it. They have not. They never even came out to remove it. I had to remove it myself. Okay? Line right there. Okay, the line that you see is the it's the continuation of the damage that goes all the way over to the, to the other wall. From there. All the way back here. All mm. this is water damage. Okay, you can see from this angle here. Come come over here if you can. This yeah, is that line right there. That's that line. From right there. All the way in that ring. Right. And back into this corner here. Yeah, right there. Yeah, yeah, that's the damage. From there. All the, all way, the way across. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And this should have been replaced because this bleeding mm -hmm. means that the that 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 the that the drywall has been compromised. It was soaking wet. That's not just water. That means that it was soaking wet. That's why we have the ring because the ring comes from the from the bottom of the uh, drywall, right. the cardboard part. And then right there, and what's that? Right. So that. now we when we come over here, and if you can point to these little holes, mm -hmm. they poke these little holes in here, but the drywall is still soft. That's him. Right there. Yeah, that run that same yeah, line yeah, all the yeah. way here, and then right up into there. The, all that's where the, the water damage was. Okay. okay, now what are we looking at now? Okay. Like what is that line? That line there? right there is from water damage that occurred last year as well. Okay. And that water damage, you see where the line starts, mm -hmm. and it runs all the way to over by where the light fixture is. And I mm -hmm. have the I have the picture to show it where the light fixture is. Well, all of that what you're seeing there is loose um, popcorn. So if you scrape that right now, you'll get a great amount of separation from the popcorn on the ceiling because of that leak. It breached it. So as we get closer. Right. Okay, so the light is off. Okay, there's the spot right here. Mm -hmm. If you run that spot all the way here, mm -hmm. this is where the damage is. Okay? It runs all the way back over to there. Mm -hmm. And this is loose. Okay? Mm -hmm. Then you get over the here. Ring. By the, you get over here by the uh, light fixture. Mm -hmm, right there. And you can see the shadow around the light fixture. Mm -hmm. Okay? That's okay. where the water soaked through the drywall. So the, the drywall is compromised. Okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, and this is the closet. Yes. Right next to the light, light fixture in the dining room. Yes. Alright, so what is that? This area here. Is and I have pictures of it. All of this, if you see these little streaks brown, up here, yeah. brownish streaks, all they did was come in here and paint this. This was all mold on the wall, mm -hmm. the whole ceiling. If you look in the little corners, you see the little brown mm -hmm. spots in the corners. All this tan is, there, yeah, tan. All this is mold. It was all over on this side, all mold. Mm -hmm. See, I got the whole wall. Okay, and. This came from a leak that was going on upstairs. This is all they did. When you get over here, you see this. All they did was just 
patched this up instead of put it in. That's loose. Is that loose? Well, it's that... not loose, but mm -hmm. it's just it's a piece of wood. Mm -hmm. But they didn't even put in another piece of drywall. And then there's a fire extinguisher missing, right? The... This paint has been painted over. Yeah. What happened is at the last summer we were asked to set our fire extinguishers out on the um, on the patio. And they would pick them up, change them out, do whatever. They never returned the, the fire extinguisher. And this is the bathroom. This is the bathroom. This is black mold that's growing. Mm -hmm. All in the, because mold grows with moisture. And there's plenty of moisture inside of the toilet. But this is what's happening with the toilets. Okay? Mm -hmm. As you can see right here. There's black mold here. All up in here. All around here. All that's mm -hmm. black mold. Mm -hmm. Okay? That, that doesn't stop, right? That's that broken too? That's something that has to do with them. I don't mess with that stuff. Mm -hmm. But that's been, leaf, that's been loose like that. I haven't put it in a work order for it because... I'm moving and they can they can worry about it themselves. But if you see down here in the toilet, mm -hmm. that brown that's not dirt. That's, is, that's mold. That's mold. And it comes every two or three days, so I have to clean it. And then as it, as it cleans up, and I can keep doing this. This has been going on since I've been here. I have health issues. Okay, I have congestive heart failure, and so I don't need to be breathing in this stuff. And I don't know if I'm breathing in. Mold. And then this is the shower. This is the shower. There was a leak upstairs in another apartment. Uh, and this is the damage from that. Hole right there, there. Right. All that's, that. All that's, all that's black mold that they tried to paint over. And this, this around never, the... This has never been repaired. repaired. That's never been repaired. And I had to ask for another shower head, but the shower head, and I have a picture of it, has nothing but crud in it from that mold 